What's up guys, in today's video of Anime Defenders, we're going to be going over update 3 and pretty much the state of, <laughs> of Anime Defenders, bro. So, I've been playing a game for a little bit now. I'm only level 38, but I do have other accounts that I play on too. But like, currently, I mean, to be honest guys, like it's 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 not looking too good. So, there's a lot of cool stuff in this update, don't get me wrong. A lot of cool stuff that I'm pretty excited for and honestly, with a simple change, I think we could definitely have a better experience but like the fact of the matter is guys like we have a new game mode hall of mirrors right and we've got a new kind of exclusive wish banner now it's really really hard to get these wishes to actually you know get the cool stuff in the banner but i'll show you guys kind of what the update's about right so this new update three we got new units added to standard banner one new secret which is shadow dragon three new mythics which is the other one and then the legendary you can get in the regular bander right uh, they're pretty much all doing some sort of buffing which is very cool very cool don't get me wrong but they like i said they are kind of hard to get now we do have four difficulties in the hall of mirrors game mode which is the brand new game mode it is pretty fun i'm not gonna lie i do like it um but it is kind of tedious i've got decent units but like that i mean i granted i did do i did duo it but it was pretty dang hard bro <laughs> and it took it takes 30 minutes that's the problem is like surviving 30 minutes um but we'll get more into that in a second right and then you get rewards on each phase play with up to 10 players get exclusive drops right so you can play with up to 10 players which like i said i'm going to talk about like how that could be beneficial for you but yeah new story mode maps which that's pretty much standard one infinite level whatever new exclusive wish banner four exclusive units shadow dragon legion commander legion assassin legion veteran and then now this is this is the this is where we want right here get wishes from nightmare mode in hall of mirrors okay and then lastly balances and misc new star fruit and then there's a uh six second immunity to stun which yeah there's pretty much a new mythic that stuns and then that's what they're referring to if you guys want to go check out my video now let's get into the nitty-gritty bro because wishes and nightmare mode so i've pretty much done like all right i've pretty much done just easy mode we're talking about two i mean three steps higher than easy right and this i'm gonna be honest this was already pretty tedious but like i said i did do it just with two people and I pretty much did all the work, right? But it is a little frustrating and it takes a lot of time. My thing with the game mode is that there's a bare minimum amount of time. Like you can, you have to be down there for 30 minutes. You cannot speed it up. You have to survive. And I think this would be better if you could, you know, kind of go through it quicker, right? Or they could increase the chances of the uh, trade, uh, not the trade crystal, the freaking wish crystal, right? But I think it's 1% chance per phase. And there's 20 phases, I'm pretty sure, right? Um, but, like, I go into the game mode and show you guys, like, it's pretty bad. Alright, so I'm going to head into the game right now. And pretty much talk about, like, I'll show you guys an example, right? What I mean. So, okay, my bad. There's 15 phases, right? There's 15 phases of easy mode i don't know if that changes but there's a total of 15 phases so the way this game mode works you pretty much have all of these oh my god that's a lot of doors bro all these doors that can open and like i said when this gets to the freaking nightmare mode you're gonna have all these freaking doors open bro and all these different paths and stuff so i'd recommend like in nightmare mode i definitely would recommend just putting your units kind of closer and then just like having really really high range units right because that's gonna really ultimately allow you to get get this stuff done quicker right and a lot easier now i'm broke right now now the good thing is i'm getting some cash right now but you don't the problem is too like your money units are pretty much not doing anything right like <laughs> like you have to wait two minutes per freaking phase bro to get some cash like to get a substantial amount of cash right which is kind of frustrating but like i said it's, this is supposed to be really hard but I think what they can do to fix this is to one, right, to increase the chance of getting the freaking wish, right? Um, which, like I said, I think it's one percent, which is pretty low, which is pretty low. 
um but it's not supposed to be easy to get right but i think that may be a little bit too low um the other thing i think they could do to fix it is just to make this a little bit more viable a little bit more easy um but it is nightmare so i mean i can it makes sense right um now the other thing would be to change this up and pretty much some some way to speed this up man because like at least in story mode you can speed things up the stronger you are like you can kind of do things quicker right depending on your strength right but like there's a literally no way i can speed this up i mean that's that's pretty much <laughs> well that's pretty much what i would recommend now let's talk about how you can get these things quickly right and how what is the economy like in this game now right so you can trade these things right now they're going to be going for i think they're about 20 to 30k pretty sure they're closer to 30,000 gems which is crazy now if you rack up a lot of these things if you have alt accounts right since you can play with 10 players you can get a ton of gems you can get a ton of gems man like i would highly recommend forget the freaking units for for a little bit get yourself some gems right and literally rack your rack your gems up man because it could change and make it easier eventually and this opportunity could be gone once they fix it but if you can if you're strong enough right try to get as many of these things as you can because that's currently the fastest way to get these things right now right it's trading that's the fastest way right um but think about it if you had 10 accounts right imagine just in some strange world you're able to do like maybe five an hour with all your accounts with two runs right five an hour that's freaking 150 thousand gems an hour right that's 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 a ton of gems bro that's a ton of gems <laughs> so you guys see what i mean now obviously that's just a hypothetical so there's no way to actually know for sure but don't get me wrong i think this update is pay to win it's pretty pay to win right now like pay to win is when there's almost no freaking way for the common person to get something in the game so for the average player like to get something in the game right efficiently right to actually you know be successful or whatever in the game to get what they want right you got to buy it and buying it is better way faster right now obviously we still have pay to win elements in the game right but it's not to this extreme like it's almost impossible it's almost like hey i'd rather pay to actually play the game which is bad that's that's pretty bad but like i said my thoughts on the whole update like bro let's pay to win you gotta have tip like you have tricks to actually get the wishes which is kind of crazy like you gotta really be like a trading god <laughs> like you almost gotta scam people <laughs> to actually succeed right but or or you can have an alt account multiple alt accounts or you can have a really great group of friends that you guys play with and you or you can just have ultimate luck right but ultimately like the way i would use this update like stop if you if you can't actually get anything like if you're not high high enough level just honestly don't even worry about it like just play the game like how you're playing it before this update and just keep just keep grinding like it's just gonna frustrate you and it's gonna be a waste of your time this is not a new limited banner so that is a good thing right so they're they're gonna still be here which is great um so i'd recommend you guys just play the game like how you're playing it and try to get leveled up so that way you can use these oh i thought he was about to go to the base i'm, I'm tripping i'm tripping um that's how that's what i would recommend guys but let me know what you guys think about this update and like give me some like give me your true opinions about it in the comments down below but yeah that's gonna wrap it up for this video and i'll make a video um to cover like the fastest way to get new gems now fastest way to get wish secret i mean uh, wish crystals right and we'll go from there but hey thank you guys for watching i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out